Okay, so now we have the beginning and the melody itself. So, One more recording, to be honest. Or actually, I should say. I should say. Let's make that recording on the fourth pattern. And let's. Yeah, we'll use an uh, automation clip for this one, or else it will be kind of hard since we're using two melodies. So I just paste it there as usual and we'll make an automation clip view mixer the master channel right here none of these but the master one drop down arrow we find fruity LP fruity fast LP click it right click cut off create automation clip we'll drag that oh no we'll drag that over here come on stupid piece of I didn't say anything bad. <coughs> awesome. Let's pull this down a bit. Actually, no. Bad. Bad throat loops. Just like that. something here. No. Well, why? Why are you doing this to me? That's cool. You'll see what I'm doing right here. Hold your horses. Because now, if I make this a bit longer, like there, no. Bad. Bad boy. Um, yeah. Let's look at Sit up at the top. Let's just make it like that. Move this. You can play around as much as you want with this, but I just I should do it like this for a second. Um, 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 um. Yeah. Make this a bit longer, like that, like that. No. Silence. And now we can add the kick. Oh, I've been looking forward for this. Towards this? For this? Yeah. Whatever you know. It's gonna be ready. <laughs> So now, if we want to make a kind of a break in the melody, I want to go to uh, the melody I have here. I'll copy the full, the whole thing, go to a new pattern, and paste it into the same. Or would I? No. I would actually want to paste it in the one... Do you remember we faded in the beginning? 
in that same kind of uh, instrument nexus there we want to paste the new one in the same we want to paste the melody we just copied in the same but on a new pattern perhaps yeah no Never mind that it was too faded I'll just make a new one let's take a random instrument replace with nexus blah 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 all that shit we'll take a dance lead we'll take our dargo or will we? nah we'll take german trumpet then we open piano roll paste the melody and then we're gonna remove a part of it so it's just half the bit faded and the rest is gonna be with kick and uh, and the melody, the full melody. So let's do it like this. Let's fade it down from the beginning so it's easier. Let's see. No. Just that. Du, 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 du. That's the only thing we're gonna copy or use. Like that. Awesome. And this part we just took here, we'll just cut that out. Control X. We'll go to a new pattern. We'll use the same instruments or things we used for the lead the main lead these two that should be see up here it's the same same thing here so what you will notice now is the thing we made that we faded will be half of the part and the rest will be the main melody let me demonstrate just like this <laughs> Did you hear that? That's kind of cool. So let's keep on making the melody a bit longer. Melody is important. Okay, that's that. Now let's add some effects. Uh, if you don't have Vengeance Essentials, well then I don't know what the hell to do, because I used all my effects from here. So either you can download the packages from one of my videos that I made. Uh, it's in my, some. it's like a kind of an old video, but I can show it to you right now to be honest. Uh, yeah, I'm on Tabe's channel, I know. I like him, he's kind of funny and stuff. Let's go to my channel. Secret stuff, don't watch. Let's open my video list. Let's see if I can find it. Right here, Fruit Loop Packs. It was one month ago. And uh, in, these, in the description of the video, if you watch it, you can download all the packs. Vengeance Essentials, Plutonium Boy, Hard Side Pack, Twister Vocal Pack, and so on. So here are all the packages in Fruit Loop packs. Okay, back to business. So I'm gonna use Vengeance Essentials for the effects on this one. Just locate effects. It should be under uh, just the Vengeance Essentials tab. And effects. And let's find a cool one that breaks the melody. The first one we would wanna use directly after the intro is finished. There, we would want some effect. Yeah. 
that one. That's cool. I've also been asked how to shut up, how to lower the volume of a sound clip up here, because you can't really click it because then it disappears. So what you wanna do is there's like a little little sound wave button up here that you can click, and then you see channel settings, and you will get this thing up. And here you can adjust the volume as much as you want. So I'll just put it like that and see what it sounds like. That's perfect. So now we have like a translation to the melody here. Cool. And we don't need a translation here because it's fading out by itself. But I'd want to use a little something about here because here's where I'm gonna start the other part of the song. I'll use that one, it's kinda cool. Maybe if there's one Let's just stick with this and raise the volume a bit. Like that. That's kinda cool. So now we have like the first part done ish. And now we can begin on the second part. You wouldn't want the melody to be too unlike the first part. Um, but you can choose yourself if you think it sounds good, but I'll just use something kind of similar to this, so I'll just copy the first melody part here. Find a new pattern. Is this free? That's free. Now let's just, like, experiment with the melody a, a bit up here. Silence foes. screams in my ears, so I'll just cut that to the other melody. Dang it, it kinda hurts. Fair enough. 